So RHD is a neglected cardiovascular disease. It, is, uh, it causes substantial burden. We're talking about 50 million people affected by it, 350,000 deaths a year. But what's particularly important is that those deaths are happening in low and middle income countries. They're happening in young people, children, pregnant women, young adults. And it is a disease that if you compare with many other cardiovascular diseases are being totally ignored by the major um, players in this field. It's a disease that causes lots of burden of disease and it is 100% preventable. It's disappeared from high income countries and it's time that we do something about it to make sure that that happens in low and middle income countries as well. There's several challenges, um, capacity development, the lack of integration, the lack of appropriate medicines or equipment, the lack of health literacy and understanding what the disease is. There are many issues at primary, secondary, tertiary level, as well as on the sort of health system level. Um, so we, we certainly have our challenges and our work cut out for ourselves. But on the other hand, if we do uh, adopt an integrated approach where we cer certainly start with awareness and advocacy um, and focus on primary prevention and strategies that can be used within the health system, secondary and tertiary prevention or management shouldn't only be for rheumatic heart disease, it should be across the spectrum, in which case rheumatic heart disease also will benefit, um, then we should be able to make inroads in this disease. So my main message to policymakers is this disease can be eradicated, it is 100% preventable and we need you to get on board to make that happen. Um, the science is there, the data is there, there are clinicians working on all of the clinical questions. We just need an uh, integrated approach with ministries not only of health but finance and trade and other areas that actually um, are part of this multi-coordinated uh, approach. So get on board and we can get rid of this disease.